Let me know in the comments, bro. Oh, shit. Son, never. And my niggas busting them UEs. And it's coming straight to the check ins. And them cusses be calling my phone. And I make them wait for a second. And them hating ass niggas be broke. Them niggas can't pay attention. But these niggas, they love to watch face. On the low, they be mad, I be flexing. Yo, what's good, y'all? It's Trees the Stoner, aka your wifey favorite trapper. Let me hear my boy smoke, man. Stop playing, man. We out here. And you already know, we in the second part of Fort Greene Projects. We here at Ingersoll Houses, man. This is the second part of Fort Greene Projects over here in the area. You feel me? So, we about to get to it. We're about to show y'all what's good. Man. You feel me? Yeah, man, I ain't been in this part in a minute. You feel me? I'll tell y'all a little story, too, while we walking. You feel me? I'll tell y'all a little story about here, you know? I'm going to keep it a buck, you know? Because that's just how I am. I'm going to keep it a buck. But, yo, I was over here probably like 20, 2011. No, matter of fact, I'm lying. 2010. You feel me? Um... I had a friend that used to live over here, right? I'm not gonna say his name, you know? I ain't gonna put his, you know? But anyway, I had a friend that used to live over here. And long story short, um... I think it was false flag and a false jacket. Yeah, he wasn't like, he wasn't like, basically, he made it seem like, yo, you, couldn't, you can't get touched or nothing in his hood or whatever like that. So, you know, I've been in his crib one time, you know, it was cool, handy dandy. Nothing happened. And then I went over there a second time with one of my other friends, right? And long story short, niggas got robbed. You feel me? He let niggas rob us. You feel me? In his house. Niggas got booked. In his house. In his house. He backdoored you before backdoor was even cold. <laughs> In his crib, up. bro. He, we got robbed for $20. Well, I had $20. My friend had $20 and a cell phone. Really, nigga? You nigga feel said, me? Nigga said we got booked for forty dollars in a metro. Niggas backed us down in his crib, nigga. In his crib, bro. He telling them niggas chill. Them niggas like shut up, nigga. Like them niggas bullying him. In his crib. In his crib, bro. In his crib. From that from that point on, I knew I couldn't fuck with dude. You feel me? From that point on, he I knew. He a yeah, I couldn't fuck with him like that. You feel me? I had to like chill away from him son because it's no way I'm in your hood and I'm getting raw bro for what you feel me for what I want to go in one of these buildings too I don't know which one though oh yes yeah let's check one of these right here yeah son bro I think it's really robbed us bro for 40 dollars and a phone bro in his house you feel me you ever got robbed yo let me know in the comments you ever been robbed in some <laughs> hold on yeah yeah here we go right here you ever been let me know in the comments bro oh Let me see what floor you went to. I said third. That's crazy how, like, you can tell, like, <laughs> you know, you chase somebody, you chase somebody. Yeah, there you like, go. Yo, we on the fourth floor, son. The fuck? Oh. <laughs> it's just boom, boom. <laughs> she got a buzzer. That's trash. That's trash, that shit hot. 
That shit's super hot. You definitely getting caught. <laughs> shit hot. That's how it look. The crib is, that's it, y'all. Uh, cribs are not really too much. He has like five apartments on each floor. Pretty sure it's big apartments. And it's about six. Yep, I was just about to say that because it's six floors, 30 cribs. Yup. You feel me? Two, three beds. Yeah, two, three beds. Facts. Yeah, maybe even four. Facts. Shit, crazy. Then I'm on my Louboutins. Hey. Yeah, bro. Them niggas was wilding on us, bro. They was trying to. They, they was. They ain't like how we was there. They was trying to be cool, but we, they was a little bit too aggressive with it. So we was on some like, oh, then like, oh, word. I bet. You feel me? The niggas try to leave. Them niggas followed us in the elevator. Niggas start fake tussling. Then we went back upstairs in the crib. Niggas backed us down. Ever since then, nigga, I ain't never been around. Like, I ain't never come around. That nigga ain't chill with him after that. Hell no. I couldn't. That nigga not in towns, right? Nah, he not in towns no more. Damn. He didn't get, he, and crazy part about it is, he didn't get none of our stuff back, nothing. He didn't get the phone back, but nothing. You feel me? Metro, nigga. Yeah, it was definitely, was, that, yeah, it definitely was a Metro. Back, yeah, that's when Metro was lit. That's a fact. That's exactly when Metro was lit. Yeah, this is a little bridge that connects to the other side. I think this is the worst side right here. I think this is the worst side. I'm not sure. I backed down. Yeah, back. yeah, I was on this side. I was over here on this side. You feel me? This side is no joke. Yeah, I was over here on this side when that shit happened. Facts. <laughs> That's the ultimate disrespect. Like. Nah, facts, facts, facts. You, you think that shit means that you get booked, like, nigga, this shit crazy, nigga, you got pokers in this bitch, like, poke that nigga all We could go bro. this way, we could go that way, which way you wanna go? Let's go this way, let's go around. Oh, yeah, 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 hell yeah, I forgot they got the basketball court over here. Yeah, man, that's crazy, man, I just told y'all a little story. I never, I never leave him, but I also call girl, bro. Word. Especially down there, like, mad subway crime going on. I learned you can't go to certain niggas' hoods. If they not valid, if you know they not valid, bro, don't go to their hood. You could, you, could look in, you could just look in their eyes and see. Yeah, like, like, nah, this, nah. they basketball court is fire here. They, but they be going, they be playing ball over. But yeah, anyway, like, yo, you go to a nigga hood, bro, you got it, and you chilling in their hood, like, you chilling, chilling. You gotta know, you gotta be on point, and you gotta know if he like official with it. You feel me? If he not official, son, you might as well be like, all right, son, rob me now, nigga. You just asking to get robbed, bro. You gotta be careful. Facts. That's why we actually doing this, just so we could be able to run in and out of these shits, and we ain't gotta worry about, you know, really getting touched like that, you know? Yeah, we ain't gotta worry about. Dumb stuff like that. You feel me? <laughs> Word. You do, don't let me see your face. <laughs> I'm gonna see you again. And again. And again. And again. 
and again. Word. Like, it, if anybody, anybody can shoot a, anybody can shoot the pipe. Nigga. It takes now that's a, a fact. Nigga to really stab a nigga in his artery and watch that nigga bleed out. Now that's a fact. Yeah, man, that's my little story for over here. Facts. So more of the story, like corporate says. <laughs> be a, be aware of your surroundings. Indians. And just make sure you're around some official dudes that's gonna hold you down, just in case some crazy happen. When um, you know, when you in they hood. Whenever shit get shaky. Word, whenever shit get shaky. You feel me? Facts. And if you feel like shit getting shaky, just abort this and get up out of there. Yeah, facts, man. If you get a, if you got a gut feeling, trust trust your gut instincts. Real shit. Trust your gut instincts. Always trust your gut instincts. Always trust your feelings, man. Or if you feel trust the vibe. If you feel a bad a bad vibe, nigga. Just stay away from it, bro. Move away from the bad vibe, bro. Real shit. That's a fact. Yo, 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 bro. But yeah, it's something like, it's okay, but at the end of the day, bro, y'all already know. Y'all like, comment, subscribe. Hit that bell notification so y'all know every time we drop a new video. Nigga, also subscribe to my boy Lucky Taking L's, man. Yo, already know, man. We outside, B. Go get a fucking bag, man. Take care of the kids and then we out here.